Hi, welcome back to Vermont Craft Tours. I'm Sarah Scully, and I have another food recipe for you today. This is for another quick and easy dinner, um, and it's a little bit more um, processed food heavy than I usually go for, and I apologize in advance, um, but sometimes you really do need something that's, you know, strikes that balance between super quick and still somewhat healthy. So I'm gonna give you my recipe for chicken and broccoli casserole. Um, and if you're vegetarian, uh, there is an option. I'll put that in the, the show notes um, recipe for you. So um, I came upon this because basically I just like to eat mac and cheese, um, but that by itself isn't terribly healthy. And so adding protein and a green vegetable to that um, really makes me feel a little bit better about occasionally making this. So um, you'll need two boxes of instant mac and cheese, um, or quick mac and cheese, whatever it is, the box kind. Um, I use an organic variety. Um, you can use whatever variety you want. Um, one package of chicken sausage. I used a style that is pre-cooked, so you can just slice it up into um, the, the casserole. Um, but you could use any kind of sausage you want, including like a vegan or soy, tofu, whatever you want. Um, and then a whole bunch of broccoli. And the way I usually make this is that on the day that I'm making my quinoa salad, if I'm roasting broccoli for that, I'll make an extra large batch and then I'll put some in the quinoa salad for my lunches. And um, I have shared the quinoa salad recipe in a previous episode, so I'll link to that as well. Um, but I'll do that quinoa salad batch of broccoli at the same time as I'm doing extra broccoli for this dish. Um, so to make this, you'll need a lasagna pan. You're going to spray that with some um, nonstick cooking oil and then um, make the double batch of box mac and cheese. I like to undercook it just slightly, so you know, 45 seconds to a minute less than you would normally cook it to eat um, straight out of the pan. Um, use the little package of uh, you know dehydrated cheese mix that comes with it um, and you're going to put that, the roasted broccoli, and then your cut up pre-cooked sausage into the lasagna pan, toss it all around. You can top it off with some breadcrumbs and extra cheese if you want and then just bake it for about 25 to 30 minutes in your oven. Um, it does about six servings, six good sized, you know, dinner sized servings. So Rick and I usually get three meals out of this. And um, yeah, it is quick and easy. Like I said, maybe not the most healthy, but also not the least healthy option for dinner. And uh, if you try it, or if you come up with your own version, do let me know. So thanks for watching, and please remember to subscribe to our channel for more recipes. Thanks.